Hey guys and welcome back to another video on the Road Builder YouTube channel. Today we're continuing the series where I start a game, make a game, start to finish, excuse me. And uh, we just, we really been cooling with it, alright? We've made jump pads, which I think are super sick. I've been trying to make as much stuff as I can that's either going to be animated or have a sound effect or anything that's just like more, uh, you know, nice. And I also switched to R6 because everyone said, hey, bro, make the game R6. Uh, I play a lot of obbies. That's what you need to do. So I, I listen to you guys. I don't play a lot of obbies, but I'm doing good. All right. Today, I want to see if I can add in coin collecting and add a leader stat for that, as well as getting that data to save. I'm not sure what you're going to do with the coins just yet, but I think it would be fun to maybe after each stage, like every time you hit a checkpoint, basically you would get 10 coins, but every time you die, you would lose a coin. I think that would be uh, awesome and rage inducing at the same time. Um, we also got this eternity made the model for me, but we made a little, uh, a springboard. So it's not perfect. As you can see, we just had a little, little bug right there, but for the most part, it works pretty good, especially if you jump onto it, it doesn't fail. So, uh, uh, we're going to definitely be using this later on in the obstacle course. And we switched how things work. Uh, you know, like all the spinners and stuff, they are no longer um, like a... S or what was I going to say? I no longer tag them with kill part and killer spin, which are two of my tags. Uh, now I just have to tag them with killer spin. And uh, within the part itself, we have values to where... Oh gosh. Uh, uh, okay. In the part itself, we have values that will make it... Uh, I can change how fast it's spinning. Um and the direction it's spinning as well. So that's really, really dope. Happy I got that far. Uh, today, the goal is add the coins. Uh, so sort of a scripting episode, but I won't be showing much of it because I'm a horrible scripter. It's literally going to be me talking with the scripter, watching tutorials, everything like that. Uh, but that's the goal, guys. And maybe some more of this zone? Not sure. You know what, guys? I guess first things first, uh, I got to make a coin. Um, I don't want to use any that I have from previous games. Uh, it'll look pretty close to the same, but I do have a simple idea that I don't want to do sharp, sharp edges like I usually do on the coin. Oh gosh, Blender's taking a minute to load up, guys. Give it a second. There we go. All right. <laughs> I don't want to do like super sharp edges on the coin, so I think I'm going to keep it. I just want it to match the game really nice. So let's go ahead. Cylinder. Boom. What is this? Unable to launch Java update and stuff. Bro, I don't care. I'm trying to make a coin. Dang. Um, all right. And now I have to delete this and spawn in another one because I broke it. All right. We're going to hit up this. I think I'm going to go with eight sides for the coin. So we have like that low poly look. I could even go six, but I think eight is going to do us. Uh, let's try six actually. Ooh, I like this kind of better in a way, but also worse. Uh, we're going to keep, we're going to keep eight. Eight's a good one for the coin. And, uh, we're going to grab our face orient, not orientation. I don't know what I'm talking about, guys. We're going to grab the face, drag it down. I'm going to grab both sides of this, press I to inset. There we go. And then I want to make this go in a little bit, but at an angle as well. So I'm going to press E, S, and Z. Z, I believe. E, S, Z. There we go. And then we could just scale these in a little bit. And there we go, guys. There is our coin. Uh, I may scale these a little more. I can't scale them like, hmm. Or maybe like this. So it's like out a little bit. I like this. I think I like this kind of coin right here, guys. I am going to go ahead and uh, shrink it a little bit. It's a bit fat for my liking. So I'm going to do this, make it a little bit thinner. And do we want to add anything within the coin? Like something, um, maybe like a letter or let me think about what I want to add into it to give it like that. Hey, this isn't just a normal coin. It's for this game. Uh, and let me think about that real quick. All right, guys. So I got a, a cool little idea. I don't know if it'll look good or bad, but, um, what if we made like a mini obstacle in the coin? All right. So I'm going to just take a cube, shrink this down, um, bring it like over here. And we're going to have to bring this guy up because we want it to show on both sides of this. Boom. Grab this face, bring it right here. Looks about the same. I'm not going to get it perfect. I would imagine. Uh, and then we'll duplicate this nice drag it this way and we're gonna do s y to shrink these in and this will be green so it'll look like you know the top and then we'll grab this again shift d move it over uh maybe move it up sure <laughs> 
<laughs> something like this guys like the idea is here don't don't hate on me just yet uh and then uh we're gonna move this guy over just a little bit more and we can add like something here um s and x i believe Oh, whoops. I kind of scaled it a little bit on accident not doing this. There we go. And these could be like the obstacles. So like this could be like red, for example. I think this will be sick. So let's join these two things together. The less parts I have to worry about, the better. Let's join these together because they're going to be the same color and join these together. And there is our coin, guys. I actually think it looks pretty cool. Uh, let's see it in game. All right, guys. So here's the coin. Um, I don't know if I quite, quite like it or not. I might make everything a form of gold. So dang, Buster, I'm sorry. I forgot. All right, guys, uh, if you could drop a like on the video, that's what Buster's going on about. Thanks. Help your boy out a little bit. Uh, I'm going to try to make all this like a gold. So right here and like darker, well, probably more in the middle and dark. So like a darker color for those right here. Let's grab these, go for a gold, a lighter color. Um, and then these, we will also do the same thing. All right. So you guys can let me know in the comments below, which coin you think looks better. Uh, I think this one works better for the game. So I'm actually just scrapping in this one and guys i'll be back when hopefully we have uh something working i'm not sure how this is gonna go all right guys uh welcome back um <laughs> it took a lot longer than expected and uh i most definitely could not do it myself um i could do like a very basic bit by myself like hey you can get a coin and lose a coin uh but i couldn't do all this other stuff so basically as you can see they spin now which is pretty cool and uh there's a whole like sound effect that plays and a whole animation i'll just show you guys what's up real quick so here's the coins that you can collect and uh just look when you collect it boom nice sound effect everything and you can just boom 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 easy get some coins we got the little bounce pad looking nice i do have uh i'll have coins like placed around on the obstacles as well so let me go ahead and show you guys that or an example of it and as you can see up here in my leader stats i now have four coins so if we grab a checkpoint it adds 10 coins to your uh your little thing so there we go and if you die you lose a coin okay now you can't go negative but uh if you die you do lose a coin so uh try not to die okay also so if you skip stage, uh, instead of getting 10 coins, you're going to get five. Uh, this is kind of to avoid the pay to win, uh, thing. Oh, oh, dang. Yeah. So, oh uh, yeah. Yeah. That's kind of tough. <laughs> this I, I, I'm bad at obstacles. Okay. Anyways, we fixed a ton of stuff. And by we, I mean yourself or myself, <laughs> your boy right here and neon blocks games, guys. He is a very talented scripter and he does a lot of scripting tutorials. We also added that confetti particle. He does a ton of scripting tutorials, especially obby folks on his channel so if you guys want to know like how he's making this stuff work i'm sure he'll be putting tutorials up as soon as he can now he is in college so give him a little bit of time but if you want to know how pretty much everything in this game works i've gotten it all from his tutorials and his help so make sure to go subscribe to him his channel will be first link in the description but guys that is going that was embarrassing that was actually embarrassing that is going to wrap up today's video all right we have a coin system now we have obstacles that are nice we have good checkpoints the little boing pads are super super sick and uh oh wait there's one more thing i gotta show you because like i said uh the previous portion like the beginning of this video was recorded like two days ago so uh i don't remember what exactly i showed you and what i didn't uh basically let me just fly it'll take a lot less time <laughs> Uh, fly. There we go. And if we go over here to the pirate place or the islands little thing and you jump on these, there's a whoosh sound effect. Look, boom. Okay. Okay. I was kind of adding it in my, my, uh, <laughs> I was adding in my own sound effects as well, but check it out guys. And then this, uh, I, I didn't do a video on this stage. Uh, it was kind of a Twitter request. Someone said, make a stage where there's a huge rotating block with obstacles on each side. Uh, it's very challenging. Okay. Everything behind this, uh, it was challenging scripting wise and it's challenging obby wise. Okay. Now keep in mind, I'm not super talented with obstacle courses, but once you get here, okay, now you have to go. Okay. Whew, and you have to make it all the way to the other side uh before it starts turning again or you're not gonna make the jump off the end so that's a pretty hard one but guys that is gonna wrap up today's video uh if you enjoyed it you want to see more make sure to like comment and subscribe have a great day later